Keith. Thousands of sturgeon spears took to Lake Winnebago for the season opener today. You're looking at our Oshkosh Skycam from earlier this morning. Ice shanties scattered across Lake Winnebago. And a first our update, fishing clubs tell our Emily Robert some of the safety precautions they are taking. One more time. 64-9. Thank you. Zach Schrader is among more than 500 others who speared a sturgeon on opening day. It's like when something of this magnitude swims through the hole, it's, it's quite a unique experience. It's a family atmosphere, it really is. I mean, you can pull up to anyone's shack and they're going to congratulate you and it's, it's a great experience. Amid the camaraderie, <laughs> some caution. The Wisconsin Department of Natural Resources reports ice conditions likely kept some spear fishers on shore. I think I see a few less shacks out there. People took a lot more precaution from going out, not going out. Fishing clubs are constantly monitoring the situation across Lake Winnebago and upriver. So there is a big difference. The lake is 35 miles long. There's different ice conditions and that's why there's like seven or eight fishing clubs around the lake. Paints Point Hook and Spear tells Action 2 News there's 13 to 16 inches of ice in the area right now, but it's starting to melt. As it gets warmer, of course, the ice will deteriorate on top first, and what's bad for ice is the wind, wind and sun. So if you got wind and sun at the same time, that's not a good thing. The Otter Street Fishing Club didn't put out their vehicle bridges this year, and you can see a line of trailers along Merritt Street in Oshkosh that people use to get their four-wheelers out onto the ice. It's right on the border of 12 inches, 13 inches, and with our big trucks, we like to have at least 12 or more. The fishing clubs, we use caution. We don't want anybody to lose their life over a fish, so. Come on down, talk to somebody, they'll set you up, tell you what, where you think would be better to go and whatnot, so they would definitely help you out. Spearing season runs for a maximum of 16 days or until harvest caps are met. Along Lake Winnebago, Emily Roberts, Action 2 News. New at 10, we asked you to send your surgeon pictures to us today and you did not disappoint. For 13-year-old Caleb Feldman, this is his first sturgeon. Now we head over to these cousins, Carson Schumacher and Owen Olson. What an awesome birthday gift for Carson's 13th birthday. Another first time spear here for Amber Whitman. That sturgeon is quite the catch. And finally, this is Mackenzie Havoc at the age of 12 with her sturgeon and her hand painted decoy she painted at school. 